Hello YouTube and welcome to video 2 of my 31 day video challenge. So last night I just finished reading the first chapter of Scott Feshuk's The Future and Why We Should Avoid It. It is a fantastic book, it's making me laugh, it's absolutely great. Basically it's about all of this technology and um, do we really need it? Do we need the iPhone 17.29? Do we need technology or dishwashers that talk to one another? Like it, it's kind of about the excessiveness of technology and I absolutely love it because I firmly believe that the world will end in a big Isaac Af Asimov uh, robotic thriller. You know, technology will come to life and destroy us all or it'll all stop working and no one will know how to live. Which is weird because I am part of an industry that is basically resting its entire hopes and dreams on technology. You know, journalism, they say print is dead. So we have all of these mobile apps and tablet apps coming out in order to help us continue to thrive or basically to pay our grocery bills. And it's kind of redundant. I don't really get it. You know, we have a newspaper or a broadcast television program. And then we have a website, which is normal. You know, everyone has a website now. But when you write the stuff on the website, you have to, it has to be different than what you have in print. Or it has to have extra links or videos or infographics or maps. And then on top of that, you have a mobile app, which can, you know, be opened on an iPhone or a smartphone. And that content is semi-different from the content on the website and on the uh, print version of the newspaper or on TV. And now they're coming out with a new tablet. You know, La Presse is doing all this stuff. And I don't really know that much about what makes the tablet so great, but apparently I've been told by very reliable sources that it is the future of journalism. Journalism will basically be all about the tablet. I don't really understand how this is going to work. So do they pay for the tablet? Is it subscription based? Am I not going to get paid for my work ever? Who knows? But it's getting kind of crazy. How many times can you write the same story for different platforms? I understand having a website and a newspaper. I read a lot of news on my phone. But then, you know, there's also Twitter and Facebook and Instagram and Pinterest and all of these other social media outlets that basically have all the news on their sites. You can access it from all of these different things. It's just getting ridiculous. How many other ways do we need to consume the news? Are we going to have implants in our ears and it's just like an automatic download? I'm thinking back to a Doctor Who episode. Let me tell you, it does not end well. Anyways, a lot of these videos will probably be about technology because it irks me. I just don't understand how it's going to revolutionize the way that I do my work. Who knows, maybe by the end of this month, something great will come out and I'll come back and I'll say, ha, ah, I was wrong, this really is the future of journalism and it will be absolutely fantastic. And I've seen some of the tablet, um, the tablet platforms and they are really cool. They're very smooth, you know, you can swipe things, you can click, there's interactive aspects and it's really great, it's cool. But is it necessary? I don't really know. What do you think?